Hey, Michael? Yeah? Have you heard a noise in the back room? No, why? Because Lady I just heard a girl screaming. Oh, okay. Cut. <laughs> Tell me a little bit about Jeff. Jeff's a functional conspiracy theorist. Um, I think it's the type of guy that when he's home alone, he's on his laptop or his PC, um, falling down the Wikipedia trail uh, until four o'clock in the morning where his heart's pounding and he doesn't know how he's gonna live the next day. But then he wakes up, he goes to school and he owns the place. Big rock formation here. Really, if you, if you were to go up a little bit more, it's just pretty muddy. It doesn't turn into a creek. It just turns into like a little pathway alongside. Copy that. We're just seeing a lot of cool rock formations right around here. Nothing really much else though. All right, I'll start coming back. Copy that. Just tell me a little bit about the, the Cartman character. The Cartman character, I have the great good fortune of playing what's called the shapeshifter or the skinwalker character. It's usually a character who's introduced at one point where they're inconsequential. Later on, they dispense some knowledge that is either magical or secret, and it helps the protagonist. Look around at different movies you've seen, there's often a shapeshifter or a skinwalker there. Um, they meet this guy in the forest and he has a cart of some sort, which is why he's called the Cartman. They're looking for aliens in the woods and they come across this mysterious man who spouts prophecies, for better or worse. Uh, my name's Kevin Serrano. I'm a film major. I'm a student at Cal State Fullerton. I met Colton uh, about a year ago on a project that we were working on. He was the director of photography. I was working as an AD. Uh, that's also where I met Patrick. He was his um, PA. So we got to know each other. We talked a lot on set. He was a really nice guy. Um, he hit me up a couple months ago saying that he was going to work on this uh, web series. He asked me if I'd like to be attached to the project, and I, of course, said yes, and that's how I got here. Uh, what really pushed me over the edge was The Dark Knight. Something about that movie just kind of like changed my life and kind of like pushed me in the way of the mindset of being like, this is what I want to do with my life. I want to work, I want to make something where I can change someone's life like that film did to me. So hopefully I can do that to somebody one day. Great.